Welcome to the elimination tattoo. You nail this and you'll have a one in four shot at earning $100,000, a feature in Inked Magazine and the title of Ink Master. As always, you'll be judged by Oliver Peck, Chris Nunez and myself, but we're not your only critics. Each week, you'll also be judged by America. Viewers at home will scour every detail of your elimination tattoos at inkmaster.spike.com and vote for the tattoo that they think is the best. America's vote will have a massive impact at the live finale. In the elimination tattoo, it's more important than ever to win tattoo of the day because the winner must put one artist up for elimination. We also have a very special guest judge. Tattooing for over 15 years, he's the owner of State of Grace Tattoo Shop in San Jose, California, Hori Taka. I would call my style traditional Japanese tattooing. I really like to do big work, sleeves, back pieces, body suits. When done right, Japanese tattoo conveys the history, culture, and mythology of a nation. Taki is one of the most respected figures we have in tattooing. True honor to have him here. This week, we're testing proportion. Proportion is the size of objects in relation to other objects in a tattoo. Today, you must all tattoo the same subject, a Japanese snake. Damn it. Snakes are one of the most symbolic creatures in traditional Japanese tattooing. Traditional Japanese is really hard because it has a whole lot of rules in it. And if you don't know them, you can't follow them. And the one guy who's gonna judge you is Taki, and he's gonna nail the out of you. Japanese tattoos are infamous for incorporating many different elements to create a dynamic image. In order for the elements to work together, they must be in perfect proportion. There is one more obstacle you must face today. All of the canvases want their tattoos on their ribs. Of course they do. Ribs? You've got to be kidding me. The ribs is one of the most painful areas with snakes. It's gonna be hard to make those long, sweeping lines. Let's meet your canvases. Halo, you won the Flash Challenge. You now have the power to assign all human canvases. Be strategic. It's more important than ever this late in the game to start aiming at the strongest artists. In my mind, that's Scott. I want a fierce snake with big fangs. Now the shots really matter. Look to get a snake right here. Rib tattoos hurt. I need to find the person that can't sit through this tattoo. What's the longest you've sat for? About eight hours. Good stuff. I want a badass snake tattoo on my left rib cage. And you have your other ribs done too, right? Yes. I want her. I want a collared snake on my right rib. Do you have your other ribs done? No. Do you have any other tattoos? I have little tattoos. Rib pieces are extremely painful. Here. And if you only have a couple of little teeny tiny tattoos. Nervous? A little. Then you have no idea what you're in store for. I like to get a black and gray cobra going in and out of my ribs. Did he say going in and out of his ribs? Japanese skin ribs. That'll be an awesome one. Halo cried like a little bitch when I gave him a hard canvas. Give me whatever canvas you want, I'm gonna take it like a man. It's for you? I know I'm giving Scott one of the most difficult canvases he's probably ever worked with. There you go. I hope that this is the one that knocks Scott on his ass. Canvases, one by one, please read the artist's name on the bottom of your skull. Melissa? Hey, love. Scott. I know Halo is gunning for me. It's karma. I guess it's my turn to rise to the challenge. Bring it. I will still do a good job. Maddie? Sausage. Remember, guys, after the elimination tattoo, the human canvas jury will vote on the tattoo that they think is the worst and put one artist up for elimination. And also, the winner of Tattoo of the Day will put an artist up for elimination. You will have six hours to tattoo a Japanese snake on your canvas's ribs. Based on your work, one of you will be closing shop. Good luck. <laughs>